American Association of Clinical Endocrinologists, Wikipedia article audio. The American Association of Clinical Endocrinologists is a professional community of physicians specializing in endocrinology, diabetes, and metabolism committed to enhancing the ability of its members to provide the highest quality of patient care. The association is headquartered in Jacksonville, Florida, USA. Prior to OSA's inception, the field of clinical endocrinology was not represented in the healthcare financing administration, health policy-making bodies and many of the professional physician societies. OSS was founded in 1991 by a national committee of 26 clinical endocrinologists to address this inequity and become the voice for the specialty. Dr. Yank Koble, Jr., M.D., the driving force and co-founder of OSS, became the inaugural president of the association. Background Advocacy OSS is now the world's largest organization representing clinical endocrinologists. With more than 6,500 members in the United States and 91 other countries around the globe, the organization has developed a robust network of professional associates and political allies. In addition to partnerships with the American Diabetes Association, American Thyroid Association and others in the United States, OSS values global ties with the International Diabetes Federation, the International Congress on Endocrinology, the European Association for the Study of Diabetes, and the Mexican Society of Nutrition and Endocrinology. These affiliations afford OSS the opportunity to provide its member physicians with an array of educational programs and activities and to provide their patients with quality and cost-effective care for their endocrine diseases and disorders. The American Medical Association House of Delegates granted delegate status to OSS in 1996. The creation of the Endocrine Section Council in 2000 allows us to represent endocrine interests on a large scale with some of the most instrumental medical policymakers in the world. OSS continues to facilitate a greater understanding and urgency among members of Congress for addressing the epidemic of diabetes in the United States and promoting a focus on diabetes and other endocrine-related disorders in federal prevention and wellness activities and in chronic disease management. The OSS Board of Directors declared obesity a disease state in July 2011 and OSS was the primary sponsor of the resolution adopted by the American Medical Association House of Delegates in June 2013, officially recognizing obesity as a disease. Obesity as a Disease OSS is working with congressional sponsors in the U.S. House of Representatives and U.S. Senate in authoring and advocating for passage of the National Diabetes Clinical Care Commission Act. This legislation creates a commission that will provide a mechanism for diabetes experts in the private sector to help the federal government address diabetes in an effective and fiscally responsible manner. The Commission will make recommendations to Congress and to the Secretary of Health and Human Services on ways to improve the delivery and quality of diabetes care. OSS is also working with interested stakeholders to advocate for a sustainable Medicare reimbursement for bone density scans done with a dual-energy X-ray absorptiometry machine and preserve patient access to osteoporosis testing, prevention, and treatment services. OSS Annual Meeting Following a report from the OSS Task Force on Obesity and a unanimous vote of the Board of Directors, OSS declared obesity to be a disease state in 2011. The association believed that this declaration would help pave the way for more effective therapies and treatments to curtail the rising obesity rate. Until 2011, Obesity had long been viewed as the result of poor lifestyle choices. However, 
sufficient evidence in hormonal and regulatory disorders and genetic components were accumulated, pushing the condition into the disease state status. Obesity is a strong component of type 2 diabetes, an endocrine disorder. OS has pledged to be at the forefront of the clinical management of this disease and its life-threatening consequences. In 2013, the American Medical Association House of Delegates approved a resolution agreeing with OS's position that recognized obesity as a disease. OS vigorously advocated for this resolution. Endocrinology Logo OS holds an annual scientific and clinical congress each year in different locations across the United States. This large gathering of member physicians from around the world provides a comprehensive range of continuing medical education sessions abstract poster tours, product theaters, and area expert presentations. The American College of Endocrinology In May, 2014, the OS Board of Directors approved the design of a new logo as the universal symbol for the practice of endocrinology and the role of endocrinologists play in the health of the general public. This trademarked logo is not designated for any particular organization. Rather it is free to be used by any endocrine-related organization at no cost. Continuing Medical Education Created in 1993, the American College of Endocrinology is the educational, scientific, and charitable branch of OSS. ACE provides professional education and continuing medical education with the objective of promoting the translation of scientific advances into clinical practice. ACE programs include the Endocrine Certification in Neck Ultrasound Program and the ACE Self-Assessment Program. The purpose of continuing medical education is to improve the efficiency and quality of health care to patients through the most up-to-date physician education resources that help to fulfill the mission, goals, and objectives of the association. The OSCME department is fully accredited by the Accreditation Council for Continuing Medical Education to provide AMA PRA Category 1 credit for physicians. Endocrine Certification in Neck Ultrasound Endocrine Certification in Neck Ultrasound is a professional certification in the field of neck ultrasonography for physicians who perform consultations and diagnostic evaluations for thyroid and parathyroid disorders. It is created and administered by the American College of Endocrinology and is recognized by the American Institute of Ultrasound in Medicine one of the preeminent, national accreditation bodies for ultrasound practices. ACE provides CME courses that assist physicians seeking to earn ECNU distinction. The ACE Self-Assessment Program is a continuing medical educational program that provides a full curriculum with up-to-date information about the evaluation, diagnosis, treatment, and management of endocrine system diseases. ASAP assists endocrinologists in preparation and maintenance of their subspecialty certification. In addition to continuing educational programs for its members and other related healthcare professionals, ACE conducts a number of patient education programs through the EMPOWER program, including Thyroid Awareness, My Diabetes Emergency Plan, and Blood Sugar Basics. The EMPOWER program is ACE's main patient education and awareness program. It has two components, the EMPOWER website, www.empowerirhealth.org, and EMPOWER magazine, published quarterly. EMPOWER magazine is a free publication written in a patient-friendly, easy-to-understand style by OS physicians who are endocrine condition experts. In tandem with the printed magazine, the Empower website serves as the online patient education portal for the Empower program. ACE Self-Assessment Program 
The website provides comprehensive information about all endocrine conditions and treatments, links to patient education programs, access to all Empower magazine issues and other resources. Patients can search for an endocrinologist in their area, share a story idea, subscribe to Empower magazine and view educational videos. ACE Patient Education Programs For more than two decades ACE has raised public awareness of the importance of good thyroid health using multiple message themes and distribution channels including television print and web news interviews, public service announcements, health fair interaction, and the introduction of the blue paisley ribbon as the iconic symbol for thyroid awareness. The online resource for this information is found at www.thyroidawareness.com. Created following Hurricanes Katrina and Rita in 2005 by the American College of Endocrinology with support provided from Lilly Diabetes, the My Diabetes Emergency Plan is a comprehensive resource for diabetes patients in crises. The plan has three components a pocket-sized checklist, an instructional how-to video and an educational website. Available in English and Spanish, the checklist details for diabetes patients the essential items and the practical steps to take in advance of an emergency situation, before they are faced with a difficult situation. The video provides patients with real-life examples of the elements they should include in their kits and can be viewed by visiting www.mydiabetesemergencyplan.com. Developed by the American College of Endocrinology with support provided from Merck, Blood Sugar Basics provides useful information for patients with type 2 diabetes including tips on how to keep control of blood sugar levels. Through the website, www.bloodsugarbasics.com, patients can learn more about the role blood sugar plays in diabetes and how to work with their primary care physician and endocrinologist to set their personal blood sugar goals. Empower Thyroid Awareness my Diabetes Emergency Plan Blood Sugar Basics Publications Sister Organizations